Spooky action at a distance. This is how Albert Einstein described quantum entanglement, one of the foundations for the success of scalar healing services from Atlantis Scalar. Quantum entanglement is a fascinating phenomenon that occurs in the realm of quantum physics. Basically, it states that there is a connection between consciousness or the thoughts from an observer to what is known as the collapse of the wave equation. You see, everything is energy, even matter, which Einstein referred to as frozen light. That means you are energy too. So the thoughts from an observer collapses your energy waves and changes them into particles or photons that can then be rearranged in any number of ways, which means any number of realities. Once collapsed, all of your other potential quantum realities are replaced by the one in the observer's thought. Hence, thought creates reality. Now, also along those lines, when I read instructions that I want the scalar uh, wave to carry to a person, animal, or even an entire household, those are basically just thoughts or consciousness. And those instructions, once they arrive at the target, say you, the new reality designed by those instructions is created. Ta-da! It's more elaborate than that, but because scalar waves can carry information over infinite distances without degradation, and because quantum entanglement links the thoughts I read and speak in the scalar field with the information I have about you, like your name and physical address, those instructions are integrated into your energy and your energy, therefore your reality, is transformed for the better. Like, have you ever stopped at a traffic light and you just felt someone in the car next to you was looking at you, only to turn your head and confirm your suspicions? That's the same thing. You see, thoughts are actually scalar energy waves, and you and the person beside you are connected through quantum entanglement. The other person's thought influences your reality, causing you to turn to look at him or her and cause a bit of awkwardness. So the same with our cell phone conversations. All of that is quantum entanglement. Now, in the scalar field, I employ various tones at very specific frequencies that I set in my uh, scalar transmitter to amplify the scalar waves. And I also use a variety of gems and stones like Herkimer diamonds to do the same thing. For more, check out my about page on the site atlantiscalar.com. Thank you.